Today is the fourth day of Vlogmas. We were doing some rainbow equivalent fractions here. It's a piece of a pie pie formed by peace. Equivalent fractions mean the same thing. These fractions may all look different. The fact still is that they have no difference. Piece of a pie pie formed by peace. Hello everyone and welcome to Wednesday, December 4th, 2019. Today is the fourth day of Vlogmas and I am coming to you at the end of the school day to let you know what happened today so we are still in i ready mode and testing and because it's wednesday it is also a short day and this morning i made sure all my students finished their reading diagnostic and after they were done with that we just went to lunch and after lunch we were working on some math and doing all the things about fractions and equivalent fractions we went into how to find common denominators and i did have the students do an activity to help them formulate equivalent fractions so let me show you that right now so here it is basically this is my example i gave students a similar sheet not with all this but just with this first fraction and they had to generate equivalent fractions by multiplying the original fraction by first two then three four five and then six so we were doing some rainbow equivalent fractions here and yeah i think the students really enjoy this and we're able to practice this essential skill before we started going over how to find common denominators and change fractions into two fractions with common denominators so they definitely need a little bit more practice on that tomorrow before they take their mid-chapter checkpoint and then what we ended up doing was before that i forgot I made sure that the students unwrap the gift of reading today. So this morning when I came in, I did take out another gift wrapping paper that I had and wrapped up the book for today's gift of reading. I placed it by our Christmas tree and our menorah. And when it was time to read the book, I randomly selected a student who unwrapped the book. And after they unwrapped the book, we showed it to the class and I read it to the class. So today's book was Layla's Lunchbox, which I'll show you right now. And it is a story of Ramadan. So it was great for the students to listen to that and be able to learn about a different culture and a holiday that is different from theirs. I did have some students that that also celebrated Ramadan, so it was nice to see them smile when they saw that I was reading a story about it. So here's the book. It's called Layla's Lunchbox, A Ramadan Story, and it is a very nice book that explains one little girl's experience trying to explain to her teacher that she is fasting for the month of Ramadan, and in doing so, she also lets her teacher know about Ramadan and their family tradition. So it was a very nice story to share with the class. All right, so that's basically what we ended up doing and the students then went home at 1.50. I do quickly wanna show you my shirt for today. It's been a little cold outside for the past couple of days. It's been like in the 50s and it's nice and comfortable and it's nice to be a little cold here in South Florida. So I am wearing a long sleeve shirt that I got from Old Navy and I wanted to show you really quickly what it says. So I hope you can see it says, Merry everything and always. <laughs> so it's a nice little shirt and I love this green color as well. So yeah, I wish I could share more on this Vlogmas. Uh, I am going to go home now. I have to do a little bit of shopping at Costco. But for the most part, I'm going to end the video because I have to go home and do some grading because progress reports are coming out later this week. So I hope you enjoyed coming along with me on this Vlogmas Day 4, even though it was a little short. If you did enjoy the video, don't forget to hit the like button. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you thought or any questions you may have. Also, if you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing and hitting that bell for notifications so you don't miss any future videos. I hope you have a beautiful magical day and don't forget to smile.
Hello dreamers, wishers, and magical thinkers. Thank you so much for making it to the very end of this video and for showing your support. If you'd like to subscribe, you can do so by clicking on my picture down here. You can also check out my latest videos here and here. Don't forget to believe in the magic that's inside you because you are capable of great things. See you next time.